The numbers are truly impressive. 49. That's the one that comes up most recently. That's the number of years Bill Barnett coached water polo after he retired in late February. But behind the longevity, some pretty strong excellence. 15 CIF championships with the Newport Harbor High School. 10 for the boys, 5 for the girls. Two times a coach of the men's Olympic team, and in 1988 helped the squad to a silver medal. These are things the man they lovingly call Coach B does not want to talk about. He's not about himself. But we sat down with the coach in his final days as a water polo coach to find out what it is he loves about the game and why he stayed on the sidelines for some 50 years. I know you shun all this legend talk, but we, we have to come and talk to you. 49 years. <laughs> why now do you decide that, you, that you're going to hang up and uh, no longer coach after this season? Well, four years ago I had four pretty talented girls come in as freshmen whose sisters all played for me. So I said, well, I'll go through it with them, and that's it. So, because people have asked me, why not 50? And I know, it's just fine. It's a nice big round number, but you're more about the people. Right. Tell me about this season. Has it been different than the others? No, not particularly. How about the idea of it coming to an end? Does nostalgia pop into your minds at all? Where does the fact that you won't be coaching after this year come in during this year? It, it really hasn't hit me. I think it won't hit me until spring because, you know, we take a break for swimming and then we usually get back into it after swimming. I think that's when it'll hit me. Right now I'm tied up with the season. We've, we've talked a little bit about, about this season and about looking back. You mentioned that you're here because of the kids, right? You like right. working with young kids and you stayed because of those four athletes. But why the sport of water polo? Well, I started in high school. And uh, I was going to go out for football, but then I missed the – tryout date, I guess. And so what was next was water polo. And actually my mom swam a lot, so it was kind of a natural thing. Did you ever see yourself then as a player moving into coaching? No. So how did you get involved in the coaching aspect of things? Uh, when I went to college at Long Beach State, I became an assistant, graduate assistant, uh, my senior year. And so that's how it kind of got into me. When you look back on your, on your career, what are the memories that jump out? Well, first CIF championship, right up there. We had a great team. I mean, they're all seniors except one. They were huge. We had one kid that was about 220 pounds, and uh, they're very enthusiastic. And uh, it was just fun to be with them. They were really gun ho to win CIF. And I'm sure once you get a taste of one championship, right, you have to come back. Oh, yeah. Summer. Oh, yeah. When you look at uh, you as a water polo coach, if someone was unfamiliar with, with you as a coach, which I don't know how they could be at this point, but how would you describe yourself? What is, what is Bill Barnett's coaching style? <laughs> I mellowed. <laughs> I used to be really hard and firm on the kids, doing a lot of yelling and so forth, but I have tapered down, and so I'm a lot more mellow, uh, quiet, and uh, try to do it that way, rather than yell. What caused the mellowness? Age. Yeah. <laughs> I also read an article that once you started coaching girls water polo, you realized maybe you had to change it up. Oh, yeah. Bit. Yeah. You can't, you can't but, treat them exactly the same way, right? No, but they're fun. They're really fun to work with. Because they'll, they'll really go out of their way to please you. Yeah. Has there been any, any thoughts to going for year 50? No. So you are, you are totally content. I, I'm done. Two weeks, I am done. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's done. You heard it there. But certainly not forgotten. He's a guy that will go down as a legend in the water polo coaching fraternity. For USA Water Polo TV, Greg Meskel, thanks for watching.